It's the worst drought in a generation. That's what farmers who live in outback New South Wales are saying, as these fertile plains, part of Australia's food bowl, see their lowest rainfall in decades. I find droughts a little bit like cancer. It sort of eats away at you. It just gets drier and drier and more severe and more severe. It's a story that's borne out in the numbers. According to Australia's Weather Bureau, this year saw the second hottest summer ever recorded. But for these farmers, it's now beyond numbers. As many say, they've resorted to praying for conditions to improve. For us, the only way that we can get life any better is for God to send us some rain. And no other business depends on the mother nature. We do. This region around the town of Gunnedah is seeing its worst rainfall since the end of World War II. And some say if it doesn't rain by the end of this year, it will make for the worst dry spell in a century. Some families who've worked on this land for generations told Reuters there is so little grass left, they've resorted to chopping limbs off trees to feed their stock. When the water runs out, we just have to sell everything and that'll be it. The dry spell has now left over 80% of New South Wales state in drought. And even as people here continue to pray for divine intervention, for now, there's no predicted end in sight.